Five drugstore makeup items I can't get enough of, all of them under $10. Come along with me while I put my face on today and I show you these five drugstore products. Two of them are five or under and let's start with the very first one. Got my hair pulled back and we're gonna start strong with brows. In this video here, I showed this $5 Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Micro Brow Pencil and honestly, it's only $3. I love this brow pencil. I like a micro brow pencil. It just is easier to do the little hair-like strokes. The only downside about this is it's just a hair dark for me, but that's okay. We're gonna make it work. If you have an issue with brows, you need to fill in your brows. I'm 56, so they are getting sparse. I do have them microbladed but I do fill in the brows just a little bit. I always start with brows first because then I have a very clean canvas and it gives the brow pencil something to stick to versus putting foundation everywhere and then it can be kind of waxy and there's nothing for that brow pencil to grip to and to stick on and stay all day long. So let's fill in brows. The last time I checked on this Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Micro Brow Pencil, it only came in about four colors. So uh, in my opinion, it runs a little dark, but you can take your spoolie and drag it through several times just to kind of thin out that color a little bit. Absolutely do not think you can beat this for the price. Micro Brow Pencils are my absolute favorite. Like I said, they're a little bit thinner. It makes it easier to make hair-like strokes, you cannot go wrong with this one. The next two products that I'm going to show are also from Wet n Wild. If you've been here before, you know I love a makeup primer. At 56, I still have very oily skin. Makeup primer just really gives your makeup something to stick to. If you have normal or um, dry skin, mature skin, and you need something a little bit more hydrating, or if you've been on the fence about primers, this is very hydrating. I love the way it makes my skin feel. It really feels hydrating and moisturizing. It gives a little radiant finish to the skin and it truly makes your makeup last all day long. This runs about seven or eight dollars. This is just a really good example that really good makeup for our mature skin, if you're over 40, over 50, over 60, doesn't have to be expensive. I love finding drugstore beauty, affordable products for our mature skin. I don't think makeup and skincare has to be expensive. Everyone now is trying to outdo or dupe all of the expensive brands. So if you like really affordable skincare and makeup, you're in the right place. I just put four or five drops in the palm of my hand and now I'm just going to apply it and it dries pretty quickly. All right, primer's on, let's move on to foundation. A few weeks ago, I discovered this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the Dewy formula. I talked all about it in this video here and ever since I started using this, this has been my go-to. I can't get enough of this. It is a gorgeous, finish. It is a medium coverage. It's a radiant coverage. It does come in matte also, but I'm using the dewy finish because as we know, mature skin, and if you have drier skin, it may be even worse for you that matte can just emphasize all of the fine lines, all of the wrinkles. So I went with dewy and it just gives a radiant finish. It's not illuminating, it's not shimmery, it's not super shiny, but this is stunning. This has a little paddle on it. And so I'm just gonna put this on the back of my hand and apply it with a brush. Again, working around my brows. <laughs> For around $5, I absolutely would say that this is one of the best 
affordable drugstore foundations for mature skin out there. I love this. I can't say enough good things about this. Now, I don't know how you do it, but if you've been here before, you have seen me, you have heard me say that I don't apply foundation any place that I'm going to apply concealer. So I worked around my eyes. So if you're looking at me going, Dawn, that coverage is not all that good. I didn't apply anything under or above my eyes because I'm going to apply concealer. So let me go ahead and put on the rest of my makeup. And I have two more wonderful affordable makeup items for you, but they'll be at the end. All right, almost done with my makeup. I'm sharing my top five favorite affordable makeup items under $10. The next two are for the lips. This is an oldie but goodie, certainly not new. This is the Maybelline Color Sensational Shaping Lip Liner. And my favorite color is Nude Whisper. I never go for a bold lip. I have very thin, mature lips. So usually a nude, beigey, pink color is my go-to. This Nude Whisper, gorgeous. Just blends in with my lips and goes with just about any color I could think of to wear. And I buy these in twos so that I don't run out. Maybelline Color Sensational Shaping Lip Liner in the color 105 Nude Whisper. The last of my favorite five under $10 is this e.l.f. lip oil. Lip oils are everywhere these days. There is a lip oil out there that is a little pricey. It's about 30, maybe even $40. I can't remember the name of it, but everyone has tried to duplicate that. I have tried a ton of lip oils. This is my favorite. This runs about $8 on Amazon. This looks more orangey, tangerine, but really it just goes on as a very, very, light, clear, even kind of leaning towards pink. Hardly any shimmer in this. Alone, over liner, over lipstick, this is beautiful. And again, I like a more um, nude, everyday makeup look, lip look, and anything that doesn't have a ton of color in it just makes it a little easier to throw it in your bag, wear it anytime you want, and even while I'm driving, I can reach in my purse, not look at what I'm doing, put it on, and not worry about it making a big mess because I know that there's hardly any color in it. And the lip oils are generally infused with a lot of really healthy oils just to really give a lot of moisture and hydration to your lips. So really and truly, don't spend a ton of money. I love this e.l.f. This is called a Glow Reviver Lip Oil. I will link the exact color that I'm using down in the description, and I really hope that you liked all of these affordable drugstore favorites. And uh, if you enjoyed this, I'd love it if you subscribed, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Go out today and do your best, and I will see you in the next video.